Hey guys, welcome back to another one. Today we have another fur bear profile in which I'll introduce an animal that can be trapped and talk about their general description, reproduction, diet, and typical ways to trap. Today's video is about Lantra canadis, or the North American River Otter. First off, we'll start with identification. Otters are large semi-aquatic members of the weasel family. Otters weigh up to 30 pounds, but are typically 15 to 19 pounds. They have a long cylindrical body, which is four to five and a half feet long, including its tail. Otters have short fur, short ears, and a thick 18 inch tail, which tapers gradually to the tip. The fur is a rich glossy brown to black along the back and a pale brown or gray on the belly on the throat, and around the mouth. The otter's strong, streamlined body and webbed feet make for an agile swimmer. The otter is perfectly suited for an aquatic life. Reproduction Adult otters may mate for life. After mating in late spring or early summer, an average of two or three young are born in the following spring in April or May. Following a period of delayed implantation in which, after mating, the female otter becomes pregnant for nearly a full year. The embryos do not begin to develop until about 8 months later and 50 days after that, the young are born. Otter dens may be abandoned beaver lodges, bank hole, or hollow logs. The young stay with the parents until next spring. The cubs will remain with the parents through the first winter, but separate the next spring. Food North American river otters consume an extensive assortment of fish species ranging in size from 1 to 20 inches and generally feed on prey that is in larger supply and easier to catch. As a result, slow swimming fish are consumed more often than game fishes when both are equally available. Slow moving species including suckers, catfish, sunfish, bass, dasses, carp, and shiners. Otters also eat a variety of other small aquatic organisms such as clams, muskrats, and turtles. They can also catch terrestrial animals such as chipmunks, mice, and young rabbits. Habitat and range. Although commonly called a river otter, the North American river otter is found in a wide variety of aquatic habitats, including lakes, rivers, inland wetlands, coastal shorelines, marshes, and estuaries. A North American river otter's main requirements are a steady food supply and easy access to a body of water. However, it is sensitive to pollution and will disappear from tainted areas. Otters are tireless travelers. In a single week, they may range as far as 25 miles. They may also travel overland from one water body or stream to another. Their territories are marked on twisted tufts of grass with scent secreted from their anal glands. Before we continue on with this topic, I'd like to take a moment and ask you all to please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Also check out our store to grab some Outdoor Experiences merch. Every subscription, view, and store item sold helps us create more videos for you all to enjoy. Every comment and likes helps us get noticed by the YouTube algorithm and helps us reach more viewers. Now back to the video. Trapping Tactics Suggested sets for otters include slide and trail set, channel set, toilet set. Recommended traps or trapping systems are the number 220 or 330 conibears or equivalents. Traps or footholds. Lure if used as all is to be used sparingly with otter musk being best. Beaver caster will also work. Some trappers use fresh beaver meat or fresh whole fish as bait for otters. Otters are strong, wary, and trap shy. Traps should be placed in the water and concealed. Channel or beaver run sets result in many accidentally caught otter, especially on runs on beaver dams and should be avoided during closed otter seasons. Fun facts. Otters are playful creatures. They often wrestle or spend hours sliding down a muddy st or snow-packed stream banks. They also play by nudging sticks across the water and by dropping pebbles to the bottom and retrieving them. Likely all this play helps the otter to hone its skills as a skilled predator. The right lung of the North American river otter is larger than the left, having four lobes compared to just two for the left. 
reduced lobulation of the lungs is presumed to be adaptive for underwater swimming as river otters can remain underwater for nearly 4 minutes and swim at speeds approaching 6.8 miles an hour, diving depths nearly 22 yards and traveling up to 440 yards while underwater. Adult North American river otters are capable of consuming 2.2 to 3.3 pounds of fish per day. A study conducted on captive otters revealed that they prefer larger fish, ranging from 5.9 to 6.7 inches, more than the smaller fish, ranging from 3.1 to 3.9 inches. And they had difficulty catching fish species less than 3.9 inches or larger than 6.7 inches. Otters are known for taking larger fish onto land to eat, whereas smaller fish are consumed in the water. Thanks for watching this episode of Outdoor Experiences. Please feel free to like and subscribe this video for more informational videos. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section down below and we'll do our best to answer. If you have a video idea that you'd like us to talk about, feel free to put that down there as well. Thanks again for watching and we'll catch you on the next one.